First of all, when they called, I thought they were just asking for permission for to for someone to represent my mom in the movie, and they're like, David O. Russell wants to meet with you. I'm like, funny, you know, <laughs> right? David Russell's gonna take the time to meet with me. Sure, you know, it's not April. Mm -hmm. um, and then I went and I met with him, and we talked about my mom, and we talked about QVC, and we talked about all these things, and I was like. Cool. He's like, I'm like, look, anything you need, anything, any information I can give you, anything you want. He's like, yeah, great, great, great. And I got to my car and got halfway home. My agent calls and she goes, you know, he wants you to play her. I'm like, really? <laughs> so I went, uh, we did a bunch of hair and makeup tests and sort of worked with it and saw what it was like. And it was a really incredible experience. My main concern was not allowing it to become a caricature. Mm -hmm. And that was very he felt very much the same way. It had to be essence of not someone going, you know, hello, worst first wife, second wife. You know, you didn't want to go to the nth degree. But it was a great experience. The funniest thing about that, though, was I had already seen myself so many times in hair and makeup during all the tests. But the first time I walked on set like that, everybody was just like, whoa. You look so much like yeah, like people didn't know it was me. And I was getting undone the first day in the makeup chair. And... Bradley Cooper, I've met a thousand times, is walking, he's like, oh, shit. Like, I totally forgot it was you. So. Hey, you did your job, then. I did my job. That's such a cool experience. Or hair and makeup have. did their job, that's <laughs> for sure.